The historic site of Wang Yangje stands at an altitude of 1,343 meters, surrounded by mountains and dense fog. Wang Yangje is also known as the world of waters. During the Jingjiang struggle, under the leadership of Chairman Mao Zedong, soldiers and civilians carried more than 150,000 kilograms of food to the Jingjiang Shan Mountains. President Hagainde Hijilema and First Lady Mutinta Hijilema have visited the site where Chairman Mao rested under the trees on the food carrying mission. The president was also accompanied by some cabinet ministers. What Chairman Mao Zedong and his team, his colleagues were able to do to wage the liberation struggle from here in these mountains then scary mountains because there was no technology there was no equipment to allow them to operate in a place like this effectively but they did it the will strategy the vision vision first the will the vision the strategy and then the programs to effect the struggle from here tells a deep story about the strength of mind, strength of leadership, and what it can achieve. And President Hichilema has called for the preservation and planting of trees to avert the climate change challenge. Um, the know-how. I was asking questions there. You can see these trees are all planted properly, orderly. And I also ask the question, because I'm inquisitive myself, the root system of these trees is clearly selected because it does go down, because it's not damaging this road, these pavements. So that is important in planting trees in our country, elsewhere. So that knowledge, that experience, will basically bear positively on both countries. For China to extend its knowledge, its experience, for Zambia to receive that, gain that knowledge, take it in, apply it in our own situation to help mitigate climate change. The negative effects of climate change uh, is important because climate change, if we don't mitigate it, we don't ameliorate the damage arising from, obviously, um, uh, the emissions, negative emissions. They will affect all of us. President Hagainde Hijinema and his entourage have since left Jansi province for other engagements in Fujian province. Mwilan Sofu, NBC News, in Jansi province, China.